guys, what is up? So this is a triple NAND, uh, and it has the MW3 uh, hazard cutout on it. Now, um, if you were to look at a MW3 console, so let's go ahead and show you, because you guys are going to be like, what is this cutout? So this is the cutout, actually. See that uh, design right there on the MW3? It is like that. So if you guys were to order one of these and get a MW3 hazard cutout, that all of that like gray right there would be cut out, that dark gray. So it's pretty cool. And we got a lot of consoles in stock. Uh, I restocked recently, so I got a bunch. Um, but anyway, guys, I wanted to show you guys this because it is pretty sweet. Um, I really love the triple NANDs. Uh, as you guys see me do the install uh, for the triple NAND, um, so I went ahead and somebody ordered one, so I went ahead and made another one. I haven't actually finished the one that I did on live stream, <clears throat> but uh, I did finish this one, so it's pretty much the same thing. Um, this just this one's all complete now. So anyway, I'll go ahead and show you guys the back of this. Turn it around. So this is where I put the switch at for the Matrix Trident. So it has a little switch right here. So you, if you were to uh, turn it to the second NAND, it would be the um, the RGH side, so that's that's the blue. Uh, the green one is the retail, uh, and then this one is uh, it's red, and this one is for the uh, RG loader side. So um, let's go to green. And by the way, um, don't switch these while the console's on because it can cause the NAND to corrupt. So just try to avoid that because um, you don't want that to happen. So. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on. I just turn it up. I'll just leave it like this. So this is the retail side. So it should instant boot. And also we have LEDs. He wanted um, remote LEDs. These are um, this is the music LEDs actually. Which I'm not gonna play any music right now. I'm gonna show you, but the music LED function does work. <coughs> Sorry. But I'm just going to go through each option to show you guys the LEDs and everything. And then we have a few other modes like jump and you can speed it up really fast. And the receiver is right there so um, that's where you can point to change everything. You can turn it on and off. So there you go. Uh, I'm gonna leave it on fade for right now because I do like fade a lot. But anyway, so this is the retail NAND, and that does work. Um, so we're gonna turn it off, and then we're gonna go and switch it to the um, RGH side. I think it has background downloads on. So anyway, if you look at the reflection right here. We're gonna switch it to blue, so it's on the RGH side now. And that is some good boot times, guys. And it reset because it's setting up the plugins. I'll go ahead and turn my controller on. I really wish the triple NAND had the read and write functions like the dual NAND, or the demon dual NAND does because that shit is pretty sweet. So I'm just going to show you guys that this is the RGH side. Um, you could probably tell by that Ninja Star but this is Ninja already loaded up. And we have XEX menu on here. Ignore that. Damn, who's that sexy guy in the background? Oh, oh, fuck, damn, who is that, boy? Anyway. He's got all these on here. Um, and then it also has the dev kit file system and um, all these other plugins on here. And... Just keeps on going, bro. 
well, let's go back to the top it has one setup files and all of the programs and everything that it needs so I'm gonna turn this back off <clears throat> and I'm gonna show you guys the um, the RG loader side so we're gonna switch that to red as you can see in the reflection it's red now turn that on and it'll load RG loader and I don't know why but I guess this is normal for RG loaders but um, most of the time it like it glitches and then you know it's ready to boot but it just takes a little bit longer to boot up so I don't know I guess that's normal but it, it does boot fast still but watch this oh shit it looks so sweet and it is on 17.526 it looks great I'm just gonna leave it at this screen because I'll let um, them set it up the, the buyer I'll let the buyer set it up um, I don't know why that IP is there because it's not connected to anything so I don't know but anyway guys I hope you enjoyed this video and if you guys want a console be sure to check out my website it'll be in the description uh, so yeah guys, y'all have a great day and thanks for watching.